been keeping this secret for a while. I've been keeping the secret for a long time. I'm pretty, pretty, I couldn't hold it one day How longer. How are you? I'm like five and a half months. And I had no, I mean, I was with you Thursday. Friday, I had no idea. I know. You were holding it in because now I can see. Well, there was some spanks involved. Oh, there was, okay. And some okay. squeezing in. So um, does it feel great to kind of yeah, announce it? Yeah, it feels really good. I mean, it's, you know, it's one of these things that I was, we were starting this new show and I'm thrilled and I'm grateful, but I was also a little nervous because there's a lot going on and I knew that, Hoda wanted a baby more than anything in the world, so that conversation was. So before Hoda knew she was going to have. Well, her I think baby, she knew. She, okay. But she was kind, you know. Yeah, but you're both keeping in that it process. close. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. she was. I sat down with her and told her, and she she said, I said, I have some news, and she said, Wait, you don't want to do the show anymore? And I said, No, I have some good news, and um, you know, it, we. I'm uh, sure she was thrilled. She over the moon. wept. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Out of happiness. Um, and so it's happening, um, but it's a lot at once. We have three babies. We have Hoda's baby, yes. baby Hope. We have uh, baby whatever. We don't know what this baby's and name is. And if there's something in the water here, I'm going to have a yes. baby, which would be a total miracle. It would be it's amazing. Great. So why, t why did you decide today would be the day? Well, we decided because I couldn't hold it one minute longer. Um, but we told our girls yesterday oh, for Easter. on Easter, oh. the Easter bunny brought them a egg with a big reveal, which oh is actually quite, Pro quite appropriate right? yeah, yeah, yeah. when you know how it happens. Do you uh, have a video to show that? Yeah, or? but but first, I think we, do you want to know if it's a boy or a girl? Oh, we're going to do that first? Yes. yes. All right, okay. so I, there was a Twitter poll this morning. Oh, really? Okay, okay so what let's we, look at the live results. What were the live results? Can anybody read that? I can't see that. Wow, many? 72%. And I'm thinking boy, too. So that's 73%. Now, are you are you feeling different than you did with the girls, with Mila and Poppy? S slightly, yes. More sick or less sick? Less sick. See, I was less sick with Ben and Gabe than I was with Lily, so that's why I'm thinking boy. Okay. Well, I so think it's we time for it? the big reveal. Should we do it? Oh. Okay, let's do it. Do I have it. to open this? <laughs> yes, go I open. sometimes think these reveal things are hilarious. <laughs> But okay, you want to help me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel so alone. Okay, okay. no, no, wait, wait, wait. Okay. Because nothing's going to explode, is it? Oh. It's, it's a boy! A boy! Yes! <laughs> oh, my God. We forgot. <laughs> we forgot about the guy. It's a big boy, obviously. <laughs> yes, well, not oh yet. Oh, my God. <laughs> I know. Anyway, you were right. Oh, oh my gosh, oh my that's so gosh. sweet. Oh, do you want a pickle? Um, yes. Oh, how excited are you about that? Oh I mean, it, my having gosh. a baby's great no matter what, but it's kind of cool to have yes. one of the other. And it's the first boy grandchild on both. Oh my God! Sides. Henry. Henry's brother has three girls, so his dad is. I mean, the thing is, Henry. We had the the attitude that a healthy baby is, is all, all that we matters. wanted. Absolutely. We weren't really trying to get pregnant. We right. had some fertility uh, issues with Poppy, so we just, you know. It was a date night. <laughs> it was a Sorry, very successful date Mom. night. Um, but anyway, and so it's a little bit of a shock, but it's such yeah. great news. And Henry's been so outnumbered, this is kind of nice. It's, it's sort going to be good for him. Field. There's going to be some less less um, emotions going on. We've, I've got, I'm emotional. My girls are emotional. And they're excited? They're, they're happy? Oh, so we told them the news. Okay, you want to see, see it? Yeah, yeah of see. course. What do you guys want the very most? In the whole world. A toy play. No, not a toy. What else have you been praying for? Baby. Okay, open the thing. What does it say? It says, a baby brother on who you will boast. Where's the baby brother? <laughs> right there. In the tummy? Yes. For real? For real. For real. <laughs> yeah, right here. What do you think, Pops? How does he get out? He gets out in a little bit. What do you say to him? Baby, baby. <laughs> this is really happening. This is really happening. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Great. And then they told every 
single stranger. <laughs> but Poppy went into Sunday school. We were in Virginia for Easter, and she told the Sunday school teacher that I was pregnant with an alien. <laughs> so she's taking it well. What, because she saw um, the picture? She saw the, the yeah, sonogram the little, picture yeah, 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 yeah. that does look alien -ish. Well, I was telling you this morning, my sanitation worker mentioned that you were pregnant, too. So I guess word gets around when the girls <laughs> they are sent out a adding it up. press yeah. release. But yeah. they really, they told the man behind us on the airplane who was a little bit, you know, sh shocked. Yeah, yeah. He was like, are you sure? Um, but anyway. Are you prepared mentally for a third baby? I don't know. How do you prepare yourself? Um, you, you don't really, you don't. I mean, it's, it's, you just kind of say to yourself, it's okay. There's no stopping it anyway. Yeah. And it will be great. It will be great. I mean, we live in New York City, so yeah. it's a little bit complicated, but I think it, things are supposed to happen the way they're mm -hmm. supposed to happen. Mm -hmm. And guys, we want to see how you share your news with your family, show us, send us your videos on our Facebook page um, and tell us how you share your news. I've never done a gender reveal. I've never done I've one I've always either. thought they were kind of silly, but that They're was great. They're great. Did you know what each kid was going to be? Did you know you were We didn't know with Mila. Okay. Yeah. So why did you choose to know? Because I never wanted to know. Oh, you didn't? No. I don't know. We just, we found the news and I could have waited. Yeah. But we went out to dinner and Henry's like, let's text the doctor. So we texted the doctor. Well, Richard texted the doctor every time or called the doctor. So Richard knew he the did? sex of every baby. And yeah. you didn't? No, but what he did was he would take the list of, of names that we had and he knew the first one was a boy. Well, that one we knew was Benjamin yeah. Edwin after the grandparents, yes. grandfathers. But the second one he knew was a boy. I didn't. So he said, if, if I can pick the boy name, you pick the girl name. I said, okay, that seems fair. So, of course, he got the name he yes. wanted, and they did the same thing with Lily. I'll pick the girl name if it's a boy. You... Oh, that's, what? That's great. Yeah. Wait, I think, do we have somebody on the telephone? Oda. Jenna. Ah! <laughs> Oda, can you believe so... it? No. Okay, first of all, I was, I hate to say I was eavesdropping on the top of the show, but I was. <laughs> and when they said, it's, uh, in my headsets, all I could hear was, <laughs> what is it? Oh it's, my God! It, it's I'm so a, happy. I know. Well, we can, we miss you. Oh, yeah, we miss you. And a lot. you know what that new born baby fog is like. So I oh can't wait, even though I'm a little scared. <laughs> Jenna, you first of all, you're amazing. And when you told me that you were pregnant, I still remember because we had some. You know, we were wondering about some adoption issues. Yeah. And as I sat there listening to you, I was praying. And I remember I looked at you and you said, oh, Hoda, I feel so bad. I said, please, don't. <laughs> and I was, I was literally kind of holding on to a little secret. And, and look at us. Now it's all out in the open. Oh. But, Jenna, I mean, I, I feel like this is your year for a million reasons. You were on the show. You were born to be on. You're expanding your family, which is exactly what is supposed to be happening. Oh. I mean, this is the year of Jenna Bush Hager. I'm sorry. That is so sweet, Oda. And Hope Catherine, the year of Hope and Catherine. I, yes, and I sense an arranged marriage. Okay. Hope and the baby. Oh, yes. yes. I didn't even oh my God. think about that. Of course. I, I got to think ahead. I um, Okay. But you know what? And when I had that conversation with Hoda, because I've been, I knew that she wanted this baby, and, um, I, my mom, I called my mom and I said, you know, Barbara, who, who just got married, and Hoda, they want these babies, and I have this guilt. And my mom said, everybody gets their babies when they're supposed to. Mm -hmm. And I thought it was, and this is a, my mom, and um, her mom before her struggled with infertility forever. So, and, and her grandmother, and yeah. Thought, yeah. So, it's true. and so I thought that was a beautiful thing to say. And by the way, if you guys didn't tune in to the nine o'clock hour, where, and hopefully Dylan's going to hang around to talk mm -hmm. with us in the next block, but. Our brave and beautiful Dylan Dreyer talked about the struggles of infertility. So I don't take this lightly. I know how blessed and lucky I am. It's a gift. It's an amazing gift. And um, and so, Hoda, thank you for your love and your happiness and your support. And, and give that baby a kiss. <laughs> I will, you guys. Great to you, Meredith. You're amazing. Love Meredith, you. Love you, so baby. Fun. Love you. Love you, right, Hoda. Love you have fun. Okay, thank you. We will. Okay. We'll miss you. have you. to celebrate your gift. Okay, okay. I'll to. celebrate it with some celebrate pickles. It with some pickles. Cheers. I'll drink the wine for you. <laughs> Doesn't taste the same.